sifters and why I use the sifters that I do, why I use the shovel I do, all of it's important. Um, this is my first sifter. Before it, I used wood ones and other lighter ones, other plastic ones and stuff. You don't want that. Um, the reason why I choose these, this one, I got, I'd say 1997. I was working in a restaurant and what they are, are industrial dishwasher screens for silverware. Um, I got this one at a restaurant. You can see I've used it for a long time, over 20 years. So I got new ones on Amazon. Here's one I got on Amazon. It was like $23 with free shipping. It's real nice. Um, you'll have to fix, I'll have to cut some plastic and put through these holes so stuff can't go out. But if you're just careful, you won't, but I would fix that. Then I got this one for 30 bucks and it's got the pieces up you know in here so you don't have to do that and the only bad thing is is when i did this video on these showing where i got them the people sold out so people have been asking about them um you want industrial silverware dishwasher screens and you know the ones they make with the sections in them for cups and stuff you just want to contact somebody that sells stuff like this the reason why i choose them you're sifting all day. You want something you can handle easily. Look at this. It's that light. You can carry it into some place. It don't wear you out lifting it. Imagine what this will do. You can use what you want. I'm just showing you what I use that I wouldn't use anything else. There's no way I'd take this to the river. You'd be wore out after 30 minutes. You know this, you can sift all day. These shovels with these handles, when it's cold like this, hold the cold. It'll make your hand so cold you can't stand it. I don't care what kind of gloves you have on. Also, when you're sifting and screening it down, the water's muddy. When you drop this, they don't float, they sink. So you'll lose your shovel at points and look for it for five minutes. These shovels are like holding a toothpick. They're light, these Ace Hardware ones, perfect angle to scoop right off the base clay. It doesn't wear you out, you can get in a rhythm. And when you drop it into the water, this end floats, so you always know where your shovel's at. I don't care if somebody give me a thousand dollar shovel, the top of the line shovel, there's no way I'd use it. I would choose that shovel. I would choose this sifter. Um, this is what I use and that's why. Hope it helps. Later. This is for Airhead Hunting in the Ohio River. Later.